Hello, my loves. Welcome back, you guys. Hey, let me know what you think of this new camera. I'm actually using the 11, iPhone 11 Pro Max to shoot this video. So I want to get your guys' feedback to see what you guys think of it. But today, you guys, we're going to do an encapsulation using enocouture.com triple x extreme tapered stiletto the longest pointiest nail in the world they said it couldn't be done but girl i came for them and i made it so today we actually launched a new product as well too which is the pink cookies glitter sets and there's a couple of different ones right now i have five with me and this one's called trick look how cool it is this one's called okie dokie this one's called gravity this one's called Buzzer, which is actually the one we're going to be using today. And this one's called Body Language. And there's High Heel. There is Bouncy and Rocket Punch, which I actually don't have with me right now. But we're going to encapsulate glitter instead of the 1, 2, 3, go. We're going to use our Extreme Tapered Stiletto. We're going to do a really long, super pointy nail. Look at that, you guys. They said you could not make a pointy stiletto in a full coverage gel nail. That it wasn't possible, that it was going to bend, it was going to break, it was going to snap off. She lied to you guys. Whoever said that is a liar. And Santa Claus is watching her. He's going to bring her coal. So let me show you. Look at that. Is it bending? Can you hear that? I'm like... And look at that. Did she bend? Did she break? No. Liars. And then we're going to take in our new pink trapper keeper. Isn't this adorbs? We're going to use our liner brush. Here she is. To encapsulate the glitter inside. Look at that, you guys. Isn't she magical? She's so pretty. So we're going to take a Luxe brush wipe. Every time you have a brand new brush, whether it be acrylic or gel, you're going to remove the starts that comes on the brush. And that is so that way the brush does not get damaged during transit. And we're going to use press-on gel to encapsulate. Okay. Put that over there. So we're going to use buzzer today. And, oh my gosh, you guys. It's so hard to choose because all of them are so, so pretty. But let's use this pink one. And we call this line pink cookies because it really does look like pink cookies to me. And they come in this little baggie that's also resellable. And then we're going to put primer on the inside of the one, two, three, go nail to etch it. And then we're going to use press on gel and clear. You can also use glitter gel polish as well too. It really comes down to your personal preference on what you want to use to encapsulate with. And glitter polish will also, not glitter regular nail polish, but glitter gel polish will give you extra glitter too. So it really comes down to personal choice. And look how beautiful they are. Like legit. So let's take clear press on gel. And we're going to apply a nice thin layer. Okay. Take your brush. Dip, 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 dab, dab, dab. Dab, 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 add, add, add. And this is so fun and easy to do, you guys, because you can literally, there's like no right or wrong. There is no rhyme or reason. It's all about having fun with your glitter, okay? And when you do it like this, your all your glitter will be on the inside of the nail too, so you won't have any bulk. It'll all be hidden on the inside of the one, two, three, go. This is also a great technique for nail biters because you're literally hiding everything, okay? You're hiding a multitude of nail sins. If you want more, just add a little bit more clear press on gel. And you can really play around with it and have the glitter however you want, my love. It's all about having fun.
Oh, we got some Diana Ross playing in the background. Can you guys hear that? Press the number four if you like Diana Ross like me. Upside down. Look at that. Isn't that beautiful? I'm going to bake it for a few seconds. You can do so many things with this as well, too. You can encapsulate glitters. You can encapsulate abalone shells. We have some really cool diamond holics that have di um, abalone shell in them. You can even put, like, diamonds on the inside, too. I'm going to have to do a video later with how to do that, because that's a really cool technique as well. Let's add some BB Mini Pearls, too, to give the nail some texture. Let's do this pretty pink one. So it looks more candy-like. Isn't it so cool, you guys, that you can really take your time adding the glitter? You can also pre-do this, too, if you're doing it on clients. You can like pre-design the nails if you have the sizes that your client is already. So that way you're not wasting time encapsulating everything. And then when your client gets to you, you just apply the nail and rock and roll, mama. That's so pretty. I'm going to freeze it for a little bit. Put my brush away. Let's freeze her. Using the DIY lamp or flashy. I got my DIY right here. Let's just freeze her for a few seconds. Okie dokie. And then I'm going to do on my nail, just to give my nail a little bit more of a pink color because I love a good bright pink nail bed. Pink press on gel is my slick layer. So really super thin, okay? Lovely. Take clear press on gel. Apply it to the inside of the one, two, three, go. Make sure you apply enough because it does have a higher apex. So you want to make sure it's nice and filled so that we don't have any bubbles. Okay. But that's why I also did the slick layer too. So that way we have that extra gel. Rock her on into place. Press down firmly. This is working and press. I don't want any bubbles inside the DIY lamp. And you guys can see I'm pressing down firmly to make sure I squeeze everything out, okay? Beautiful. Now let's bake inside of the Dazzling Darling Lamp. I'm just going to do it for 30 seconds because I am going to be taking the nail off. Because you guys know I cannot wear the long phalanges. I cannot function junction. So it's really important we always cure the final layer for at least one minute inside the Dazzling Darling Lamp to ensure proper curing and ensure that everything sticks beautifully and you don't have any issues with the nail. That's really super important. Okay, you guys? because that will help avoid 99% of any issues that people have with the one, two, three, go. There we go. And there you have it, my love. Beautiful, glittery sculpture nails using one, two, three, go. Check it out right now at enocouture.com.